Hey, come on along. Let's check out the day of eating. Um, we're going to have a great day. We're going to have some pizza. Um, we're going to have a salad. We're going to have a, a really good day. I see some workouts stuff and what I do for workouts, some different exercises and stuff. So come on along, hang out for the day and check out what I do for the day. Good morning. How's everybody doing today? Hopefully you had a great weekend. Hopefully the holidays were good. Um, some good ones coming up. Here we are, another day of eating. What are we doing today? Um, so we are going to continue on with the 16-8 uh, <clears throat> kind of uh, fasting. So that's what the plan is. So we won't be eating until uh, lunchtime today. So today is just a cup of coffee in the morning. So um, it's just my coffee. Oh, let me get a spoon here. Hold on a second. I got a spoon, I got my coffee, get that started. So just instant, it's just instant coffee, that's, um, and then I have, again, I started using this collagen, this Beyond Collagen, so it's the same company that I use my other collagen from, but this one actually had that, uh, the, uh, the uh, biotin in it and the vitamin C in it as well as the collagen so I'm gonna put that in my coffee um, pretty good they had a uh, for the Black Friday weekend they had a 40% off uh, so it was a good deal so, uh, it's, it's good stuff I'm gonna try it for a while see if it's any different um, as well as you know collagen needs that vitamin C to work they, they are partners and they work together so if you're not taking vitamin C and you're taking collagen, then the collagen isn't going to work very effectively. So you need to take vitamin C. So this has it mixed in there together, 100% of your daily requirements of vitamin C, which I think is good. So hopefully uh, it helps, and we'll see. We'll still use this for a while. And one scoop of it all right that's all there is to it I just wait for the coffee to get done water to heat up and uh, yeah. so how are you doing what are your plans for the holiday what have you uh, Tell me down in the comments down below how you uh, plan on staying to your plan and uh, throughout the holidays, or uh, you know how are you gonna make it through the holidays. So um, let me know. Um, just kind of be kind of curious and see how everybody is doing. And you know, say with Thanksgiving we had a pretty much we stayed keto. Um, so that was pretty good. Now these are just, this is that monk fruit extract. So zero carbs, zero calories. A couple drops of that in here. Stir up with this. All right, and there we go. So that's the morning. That's the way it will be for all for all the rest of this month, and then. Uh, We'll talk more about how, what we're going to do for lunch a little bit later. I'll see you in the next segment. All right. So just a real quick like, this is what I'm going to have for lunch just to show you. So I have some leftover keto pizza that we made a while ago and froze. So I'm going to have that with the two baby bells. And I'm back to uh, eating the yogurt. 
I'm actually going to bring these a uh, couple of cookies with me. I'm not sure I'm going to eat them or not. I'll see how I feel um, and then see how we go from there. So um, that's my lunch. Um, I'll show you more when I get to work and heat it up and see what it looks like. All right. All right, here is my lunch keto pizza that we made. A couple of cookies. I'm not sure I'll eat those or not. Um, maybe, maybe not. Um, and then <coughs> baby bells, the, the yogurt, some keto chow uh, electrolytes in my drink. So that's my lunch. I'm going to go eat it. by worth I desire your worst so you can just hide while I work I ain't tired you first I'll write a second third verse about the lies you go disperse you never did sh I know it hurts but something deep inside won't let me quit I swear that I'm inspired by all this all right so we're done eating for the day I think we're done eating for the day as far as I'm concerned I'm done I'm not gonna have plan on anything else um, it's around uh, a little about 6 10 or so so um, fast now from the next uh, next uh, 16 hours, right? So it'll be about 11 o'clock tomorrow before we eat again. So that's at least that's planned anyway. So hopefully it's working out. Hopefully it was a good day. Hopefully you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed it. Um, what a great meal. That I love salad. So um, it's a really, really nice full filling meal with the protein in it and and all the, the, the spinach and arugula and the avocado. It's just full of goodness it's a lot of vitamins and minerals and a lot of really goodness in it as far as i'm concerned um keto pizza is one of my uh the chicken crusted pizza is one of my favorite uh favorite foods we love that thing we make them all the time we make that probably a couple times a month usually when we make it we make enough so that we can freeze a bunch of it and then we can just pull them out and uh have them especially for lunches and stuff like that to take them to work and stuff like that so just a great overall um, lunch at work quick and easy something different something you don't think of um, and people when they see me eating it they say all right I thought you were on doing keto and I say well this is a keto chicken crusted pizza so it's actually almost zero carbs we don't put sauce on it so the sauce is what gives you the all the carbs really so the pizza is like one carb or something like that so it's virtually almost zero um, but anyway so it was a great day. Um, got in some exercise as well. Um, so I'm going to try to do that. Make sure I do that three to four times a week. Um, kind of mix it up a little bit. Um, so one day with the weights, maybe another day more of uh, aerobics and um, uh, midsection work, uh, ab work and stuff of that nature. Do some kind of Tabata or something like that. Um, and then some kind of a lower body work. So you'll see a little bit of that today as well. Um, so um, hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully you think it's it's pretty good. Um, let me know in the comments down below if you like these. Um, what else would you like me to see or do? Um, you know we haven't done any. We didn't do a grocery haul or anything else, and probably won't be maybe this week just because of the fact that uh, after Thanksgiving we have a lot of leftovers. We've been eating a lot of leftovers. Um, I was going to show up. So hey, up here is um at my Thanksgiving dinner. So you can see that we kind of. Stayed pretty close to keto. We had steak, we had the, the shrimp, um, bacon wrapped shrimp, we had lobster, um, we had green beans, um, we had lumpia, we had a buku, keto buku pie. So uh, a lot of really good stuff. Um, 
So we probably went way over on our carbs just because we ate so much. But I thought it was pretty cool just to, to show it to you and kind of see how how did you do, how did you do, and kind of start thinking about Christmas, what are you going to do for Christmas dinner, and those type of things. Because you don't have to stay tradition, right? Um, do what's good for you. I would much rather have the bacon wrapped shrimp and the steak and the lobster um, and the lumpia versus just uh, turkey and mashed potatoes and corn. Um, I'm just, you know, I'm just saying. That's just me. I would much rather have what we had than than that. So, um, all right. So I'm going to talk a little bit about the, what I do for today for eating purposes. Oh, I do want to make sure that hey, go down there and check out the links down below because I got some really cool links down there, affiliate links. Um, uh, if you're interested in a uh, continuous glucose monitor, um, there's actually a $25 discount down there from NutriSense if you go down there and check that out. Um, so go down there and check that out. All you got to do is fill out a survey and they tell you whether you're qualified or not for it. And I'm sure you will. Um, and then there's a bunch of other links down there. Keto Chow, 10% down Keto Chow uh, as well and some other good ones. So, um, so for morning, for breakfast, all I had was a coffee. I did put the Latana in it and then I put in uh, the, uh, the collagen in it. Um, and then for lunch, I had the chicken crusted pizza. I had the, the ratio yogurt, and then later in the day, in the morning, I had those baby, two Baby Bells um, semi-soft cheese in there, which I love. Um, and then for dinner, I had spinach, arugula, um, with the avocado, some chicken breast in it, and then I ate a chicken leg besides that too, a small chicken leg as well that we had left over from the other day. And then we had some planter's peanuts in there, lightly salted in it as well. Um, so that's kind of what we ate for the day. Um, I'm very, very full. I'm very, very satisfied. So this was uh, the macros up here. I'll show you right up here. So the protein was 172. So the protein was really high and mainly because of the chicken and uh, you had the chicken crust. Um, the chicken crust of the pizza is just made, it's all chicken breast. And then the chicken that we ate in the salad today and the spinach, of course, and everything else. And then the fat was at 99. So that was pretty good. I was happy with that. Um, and then, of course, calories was 1,754. I'm okay with that. That's good. My total carbs was only 15 for the day, um, so that's good. So I could have a cookie or something if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. Um, I'm just trying to kind of keep that deficit and try to re uh, try to how do I say uh, reset myself from from eating so much the last couple of days. I I'm, I love eating, and and I had, it was a great couple of days. Um, and it set myself up for uh, Christmas coming up. And then fiber was seven, so my net carbs was only seven. So it was under a 10 net carb day or under a 15 or 15 under um, uh, total carb day. So that was my day. Um, hopefully you liked it. I know uh, I did, I, I had, it was really, really good. Now, not every day is as good as this. Um, a lot of them, you know, just don't go as well. You can't always plan out. I know with Christmas parties and everything else coming out, Right now, it's it's going to be tough. So uh, just hang in there and do the best that you can. Life's not perfect, and uh, you're not going to have a perfect diet every day, right? So um, enjoy yourself, um, and then you just make up for it on the other days, right? So um, hey, if you like the video, make sure you go down there and you watch this next video over here, or you watch click on this Alan's awesome logo over here because you guys are awesome. <laughs>